The Lewis Swing Bridge in Lewes, Delaware was the last operational swing bridge in the nation. It was initially slated to be demolished, but the Lewes Junction Railroad Association, historical activists, and residents felt it was necessary to preserve the history of this iconic bridge. The bridge opened in 1916, where it first served the local fishing industry. It later became a direct route for supplies to Kent and Elopen and served as the backbone in the construction of Fort Miles on the Delaware coast. Early efforts to relocate the bridge to its new home off American Legion Road were halted by weight and capacity issues. As digging and rigging has one of the largest cranes on the East Coast, we were contracted to lift the bridge from Lewes and Rehoboth Canal with our Lee Bear LTM 1759.1. Digging and rigging moved the crane into position for the removal of the bridge on Monday, February 14th. The equipment was configured to replicate the details provided by the lift planning department. They utilized computer-aided software to ensure the lift could be handled in the safest manner based on the weight and capacity restrictions identified by the contract. By early evening, the rigging was affixed to the bridge for the Tuesday morning lift. As crews started to appear on site Tuesday at 7 a.m. to finalize their preparations for the removal of the bridge, they were joined by many locals and newscasters. Shortly after 9 a.m., the 190,000-pound bridge was lifted off its turntable and positioned to be loaded onto the trailer by 9.30. The 900-ton crane effortlessly raised the bridge from its home on the canal and loaded it onto a truck to be hauled to its new resting site. The bridge then started its journey to American Legion Road, where it would become the focal point of the junction and breakwater bike path trailhead. After the bridge left, the hardworking crew from digging and rigging started to break down the LTM 1750. By 6.30 p.m., the tireless crew had moved and rebuilt the crane to the new site to offload the bridge the following day. The crane and crew were set to make one final lift of the swing bridge on Wednesday. The loose swing bridge was lifted from its transport trailer Wednesday morning and secured to its pedestal by 10 a.m. Shortly afterwards, the DNR team began another seamless breakdown of the LTM 1750 and returned to its dispatch yard in Frederick, Maryland.